we're gonna do a quick energy check see what your ancestors the universe the divine want you guys to know as you're navigating through your journey ascending to your highest good I've already called in the appropriate protection this is a time this reading is whenever it finds you we're gonna jump into this guys how are you guys doing First card out, humanity and benevolence, faith, stay calm, trust the, God, tr trust the good in yourself and others, see the light in the world. A lot of you guys are trusting in divine timing right now. A lot of you guys are seeing good in people. A lot of you guys are understanding that everyone's on their own journey. You're seeing the good in yourself and others. Soul expansion. Your consciousness is expanding. You understand the connection between all things. You're understanding that everyone's on their journey. Everybody's not on the same timeline as you. Everybody has their own path, their own lessons that need to be learned. You're no longer getting mad at people for not seeing things like you. Some of you guys could be dealing with an air sign, a water sign. Devotion. Devotion. Trust your spiritual guidance. Your commitment has been recognized. You are loved unconditionally. Spirit is, is wants somebody to know. Somebody's been asking Spirit if they're on the right path, if they're doing the good things, are they being, are you proud of me? I hope I'm making you proud. Spirit said yes. Your devotion, your hard work is not going unnoticed. You're loved. Your commitment to your journey has been recognized. Expect a miracle. The Holy Spirit. Oh, this is beautiful. Remember that only love is real. Miracles will occur naturally. Spirit has your back. Somebody's spirit. Spirit guide wants them to know they have your back. They're working. They're working tremendously behind the scenes for you. And your your de devotion to this path, to expanding, to helping out in humanity, being of service, loving, seeing people through the eyes of the divine, loving each person no matter what they've done to you. Still walking around with that love in your heart. Keeping a pure heart, light as a feather.
I love waking up in the morning. It's so refreshing. It's like you've calmed your whole body, your energy down to wake up to like hearing and feeling the energy within yourself. It's a soft little buzz and it tickles through your whole body. That's your natural state before you go out to the world. Somebody's on the right path here. I'm sorry, guys. You guys know? <laughs> this song is my song. This was the first song that I heard of her that made me fall in love with her. Somebody's expanding their consciousness to the 4D, 5D. And they're looking at all people through the eyes of love. And that's a beautiful thing. When you could sit there and know somebody's intentionally lying to you, but you st you forgive them even, either way. When you know somebody's been talking shit about you, and you see only love in that person, and you forgive them anyway. When people have backstabbed you, broke your heart, and you still forgive these people anyway. Thank you, angels, for inspiring me to be more like you. Somebody here could be really an earth angel. Because spirit just put that in my head. You're being a vessel. Uh, uh, uh. Spirit is using you as a conduit to show other people how it's done. And your work is not going unnoticed. <laughs> Empty well, time to replenish. Some of you guys felt like, you know, am I being recognized? Am I being, am I on the right path, Spirit? Give me a message. Spirit said, get ready, because your well is about to be replenished. Spirit has recognized your hard work. Hey. <laughs> Number 16 breaks down to eight. Eight talks about abundance, baby. love that you have for humanity, giving back to your community, helping out the homeless. Expect a miracle. Your devotion hasn't gone unnoticed, Spirit said. Teach ability at the bottom of the deck. I'm being called to grab this card. No, 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 no. 
I remember when I first heard her. I was so excited to show you guys her. This is the first song I've ever heard of her. And it's been a wrap. This is my song. Every morning message, you're gonna hear her. She's phenomenal, this lady. She is truly, her music truly heals. Her voice. Stepping into stillness. My power is born in the majesty of silence. I feel like with this is what I was telling you guys earlier. When you're first waking up and you're hearing your, your, your own energy, it's like a soft little buzz that you could hear and feel the tingly all over you. Somebody here. Exceeding expectations. You're exceeding all spirits' expectations. Somebody here has a strong connection with the moon. Like they stay up talking. The moon is listening to you. Somebody here has a strong connection with the moon. <laughs> You're exceeding all spirits' expectations. I soar into excellency. Excellence. You're exceeding all spirits. Somebody's asking spirit, am I making you proud? I hope you're noticing what I'm doing. I hope you see. Are you still, like, somebody's talking to their spirit guides. Their spirit guide wants them to know you're exceeding all their expectations. Your devotion, your work is not going unnoticed. This is the second expect a miracle card. Somebody. Miracles are blossoming in your life. Yes, it is. I see it. Spirit keeps making me talk about this. Somebody wakes up like, Ooh. hey, baby, what are we doing today? <laughs> I only see beauty and grace. This is how somebody's looking at people, with the life, their, their, their circumstances, their situations with the eyes of love, knowing that spirit got their back. When things start to fumble, things are not going your way, you just have a knowing. My ancestors will never leave me down like this. There's no need to panic. They got my back, they're working on something. Somebody has a strong connection. Yeah, somebody has a strong connection with their ancestors. Because the way Spirit is showing this to me, it's like you're just traveling. You're just traveling, talking in the night stars with the moon. Hey, moon. How you doing today? Let me tell you about my day. 
This is weird. What are you making me do, Spirit? You're making me feel like I'm reading like a little kitty book. Hey, Moon. <laughs> is not about to be empty. Spirit is about to replenish it with miracles. Get ready. Somebody's looking at people and their situations with the eyes of love. Pre-recognition. Psychic ability. Future vision. Number 13. Somebody's like, I know Spirit got my back. I don't care how much this tower starts falling or or whatever is falling behind. Spivet has my back. They're not going to leave me like that. And you're right. Somebody's right about that. Their ancestors are like, no. We are recognizing you. Your dedication and hard work is not going unnoticed. Trust in divine timing. Expect a miracle. Be open to receive that miracle. Because miracles come in all forms, guys. Death after rebirth. Here's the here it comes, guys. Here it comes. Darkness to light. No matter how hard the circumstances, this is what the spirit is showing me. This person still has faith. Get down, Yin. Leave the birdies alone. Somebody still have faith. alone this is what spirit is showing this to me just know you got somebody strongly connected to the animal kingdom i keep picking this person up in my readings you're strongly connected to the animal kingdom trust the animal that somebody really needs to start looking up the animals that are passing through passing them there's messages in every the vision even when you didn't see your rewards coming in you still stuck through it somebody's about to be rewarded this year if you guys had like a tough patch in 2022 not no more Archangel Raphael, fourth chakra, that's your heart. Somebody has healed. Somebody's looking at people through the eyes of love. What did I say? I, I read that quote, Spirit put it in my head. Thank you, angels, for inspiring me to be more like you. Loving, seeing people through the eyes of the divine. Understanding that everyone has their own journey and we're not here to place judgment on no one. You are not superior more than anyone. And somebody realizes that we are all connected energetically. 
to place judgment on one, you place judgment on self. Somebody's learning to walk away from people places, things, and emotions with the purest, highest form of love and light. <laughs> Somebody has a strong connection with spirit. Spirit's been with you. They want you to know they're recognizing you. Let them work. Let them bring in these memories, man. Yeah, you healed that broken heart. You healed that broken heart. You healed that broken heart. Look at abundance and blossoming at the bottom of this deck, rising above it all. Teachability. Somebody's going to be able to learn how to use what they've went through and help other people heal. Help other people have this rebirth. Expand their conscience. Hold on to faith in humanity and the divine. This is a beautiful reading. Sacred Mountain. Somebody here astral projects. Somebody here astral projects. That's why I kept getting. At nighttime, you speak with the moon. It's like your soul leaves your body, your spirit leaves your body, and you're traveling like up, up, up. I remember when I was a little girl, that used to happen to me a lot. I remember astral projecting out of my body and flying out the window, up, 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 up. As high as I could go, my body used to tingle all over. I remember going from my grandmother's house and visiting my mom. It was so weird. I thought I was dreaming before. Now that I'm in my, my journey and as I got older, I started realizing astral projection is real. Somebody is astral traveling. Vivid is about to come in and give somebody a vision. Take them on a quest. Door to spirit. Vision quest. And spirit's going to take you to a sacred mountain. Spirit is about to take you to a sacred mountain. Somebody's psychic abilities are about to enhance. Blossoming in abundance. Mm-hmm. Winter. We are in the winter. Rebirth.
some of these psychic abilities are about to be enhanced. Divine Feminine. Your guardians are about to come and visit you. You're about to, listen, you're very protected, whoever I'm speaking to. You're about to go on a, on a mission, on an adventure with spirit. Somebody's about to get a, a, a visit from spirit. And they're going on a vision quest. They're going to be traveling to a sacred mountain. You're going to remember this. This, this ability opening up for you is going to bring you prosperity. You're going to be able to help. Use your gift to bring this prosperity into your life. Rebirth. After one ending comes your rebirth. What did I say? Somebody here, if your finances were shitty... If you were barely making it in 2022, not this year. Mm -hmm. Autumn. Manifestation. You guys could have been seeing your money, you're struggling in autumn. Spirit said, this is about to change. Your manifestations, your whole foundation, and your security is about to change for 2023. This is what I got for you guys. Spirit said, get ready. Blossoming in abundance. Balance is here. After this storm. After this fight. What did I just say? Financial constraints. Storm. This made you appreciate more. This grew your strength to spirit. This is what I got for you guys. Love and light.